Joanne, tell us a little bit about the Fishing Derby, how it uh, started and uh, how it's grown uh, through its uh, two years. It's kind of been a dream of mine since I was an apprentice at the training school. We have this beautiful facility, 400 plus acres. Um, I thought it'd be a great opportunity to use it. So I mentioned it to uh, Alan Perot a couple years ago and he thought it was a fantastic idea and it took off from there. Last year was our first year. Tom, what a wonderful event. To have an opportunity to share solidarity with the membership, but more importantly, uh, introduce their family members to Local 17, it's just a great day. Oh, there's plenty of bass in here, uh, bluegills, crappie, perch. Um, we did stock it this year with trout, and we're giving away special prizes for the people who catch trout this year. Jesse, what did you catch, and are you having fun today? Mm. It's a sunfish. Sunfish, and I am. How long have you been out here, since this morning? Mm-hmm. You put What are you putting on your hook that you're able to catch these kind of fish? A uh, thin worm. I don't think I know of any other union here in western New York that does something like this for its members. Is, is this a first? As far as I know, it is, and it's fantastic response. It grows every year. Um, there's over 200 people here this year. It's Everybody's having a great time catching some wonderful fish. We're very fortunate that this membership owns about 467 acres here in Hamburg, and part of this property included a, a prior manufacturing facility for a brick company. And part of that brick company's uh, uh, utilized the, the pond in the manufacturing of that process. So we're able to take advantage of, of just a great, uh, a great piece of land. I think it's great. It's just like these little guys. They have a ball. It's really good. It's a good thing. Does it go a far away in building uh, camaraderie, brotherhood, and sisterhood uh, inside the union? Oh, absolutely it does. Absolutely. They don't come any better than us Local 17. <laughs> it's something for the local to be proud of. It's a great thing. This is all about family. It's our family fishing day. It's, that was the main purpose of the whole thing, is to get our, we work so hard during the year that this is our opportunity to get people together to blow off a little steam and have fun. You gotta have solidarity. That's the only way we exist. I think, uh, was it um, Thomas Jefferson that said it best, if we can't hang together, we'll surely hang apart. And so an event like this brings us all together so that we can at least enjoy not only our company, um, but also, you know, the significance of the local union that they've created over the years. We have a local member who's a woodworker, and he made some gumball machines for all the people who catch trout. Um, all of our other prizes uh, would, uh, are sponsored by Gander Mountain. They gave us a tremendous discount this year on our prizes. Final question, what's on tap for next year? How are you going to top this? Somebody said, can we put shark in? the pond, and I'm, I'm not sure that we can. But <laughs> Now what about a couple of members with that little fin on their back and swimming a little bit underwater? <laughs> That's a great suggestion, Tom. <laughs> I think for next year we'll just look to continue to grow the amount of members that are enjoying this property.